Big shout out right there to the homeboy Salazar, man. Straight out to three hundred five. Do we even know what they're saying? No, that's what I'm saying. Yo, I know what they're saying. Yo, What's shut that? the fuck up. <laughs> they're, saying, they're saying a lot of things. I'm gonna yo, tell you this, yo. Next time, yo, I want some fucking um the lyrics and shit. You know what I'm saying? Send the shit in in English. Type it out. Hell yeah. Tell yeah, me what yeah, y'all yeah, saying, yeah, man. Yeah. The shit sound good though. Regardless, I like that. Man. I like that. Good, good shit. Good man, we played them back in what was it? Episode number fifty, man. Was it in, in Spanish? Miami show. Oh, you right? Yeah, they um. It was like, I got you. Yeah. That was the shit they yeah. had last time. I like that. Shit was killing How's that go again? Something for the mommies. What's that? How's that go again, dude? I got you. I got you. <laughs> and yeah, I don't know. Penis. <laughs> he, he probably That's said it true. word for word. He don't know what he said, but he said it word for word. <laughs> shit, man. But, um, yeah, we about to get Fatty Daddy on the phone here yes, in a second. Go holler at him. Right. Um, He he's, calling he, in or we on, calling he's him? He's on the line Is right he? Now. Oh, yes, my bad. Hey, yo. What's good, man? What up, bro, bro? What's poppin'? Man, what's going down? What's happening? Nah, man, shoot nothing, man. We just, you know, chilling on a Sunday, man, doing what we do, man. Took that win. Hell yeah. That goes up, man. Hell yeah. But definitely, man. So, um, yeah, man, tell us about your track, man, about the your scene down there in Texas. Oh, that track, there, guy, that's my, that track called My Life, I think. Yep. Uh, yeah, that's the one. Yeah. I'm down in Dallas. I got it crazy. It, it, it's it's like heavy rotation in Dallas right now. Oh on no both shit. radio stations. I like that. Oh okay. Now tell me what's um is Dallas? What's the scene like down there compared to like Houston? What's the difference? Or I mean, Dallas more more city like like we really we really the city. Houston like really a little southern, a little more southern. But Dallas it's more city, more fast life. Oh okay. Dallas, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Or it's more it's more corporate. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah I feel you. Yeah, you got more companies and all that down there? Yeah, a lot of companies. You know okay. what I'm saying? Everybody's starting companies. Uh-huh. There's probably about 300, 300, 400 record companies in Dallas by itself, bro. Damn. All right, that's what's Independent up. Independent record companies. Jesus. Now, um, so now, how come Dallas, in your opinion, ain't made the splash like Houston has? I mean, because Houston got, you know, Paul Wall, Mike Jones, lots of representatives. What's the difference? Because, I mean, Dallas ain't much smaller, though, is it? I mean, they about the same I mean, size? That, I mean, it just, it just, it's just like a four. It's just like uh. Uh, like a tire and tape, you know what I'm saying? Houston get on first, then Dallas get on. You know, how, you know how Cash Money did. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. We all we all associate with each other. You know what I'm saying? But Dallas just had to had to come right behind Houston to follow up on Houston. It's, it's basically the same. You know what I'm saying? We we basically all of us fuck with each other. Okay. You know what I'm talking about? But a lot of things with Dallas, a lot of artists in Dallas don't really get behind each other. I don't really think it's 400 or. 500 independent record companies in Houston, you feel me? Yeah, definitely. I hear you. They, they, they are, it's about 12 of them, you know what I'm saying? They just all form together. In Dallas, everybody want to have, everybody want to be that dude, you know what I'm saying? So it's kind of hard. But see, that's what I love about the South, man. Everybody takes care of everybody down there. You don't see that <laughs> shit in, in the East Coast or, or sometimes yeah. you see it on the West, but man, down Far South, few. everybody few. takes care of everybody, it seems like. Yeah, it's love down here, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, cause I so know they you. Gonna, everybody gonna look out for each other. Like Houston blow up. Houston artists get love in Dallas. Dallas artists get love in Houston. Now you mentioned the radio play. You said you're getting lots of love. It's heavy rotation. How hard was that for you to get broken in on your local yeah, station? Who, what, what DJs do you speak It's hard. It's real hard, bro. I've been I've been doing it for like eight years. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So, and so that single been out for about a year. You doing that independently? Independent, yeah. So are you having? I mean, honestly, do you have to pay DJs off for them to spin your shit? I mean, or- sometimes you do, but other times you just got to get to know the DJ. You know what I'm saying? DJs don't want to be forgotten. So we down here, we 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 really support the DJs. You know what I'm saying? Oh, okay. So if you support the DJs, they gonna play you in the streets in the club. Gotcha. They play you in the streets in the club. The radio station gonna play you on the radio. You know what I'm saying? Oh, so yeah. you it always you got to go with the DJs. Okay, so you don't got to mess with DJs. So we we really support our DJs down here, bro. Okay, no, that's what's up. That's like, what's yeah, up. it's a lot of DJs down here that don't really get that much love, but it's a lot of DJs down here that's that's really doing things. Well, I'm just speaking of like radio DJs. I mean, are they? Yeah, a lot of club DJs. Most of all the club DJs is radio DJs. Oh, okay, okay. gotcha. Okay. okay, you feel me? Yeah, definitely. So they they the radio station control the clubs. Well, that always kills me. Up in our area, man, you got to pay these fuckers to spin anything. It, otherwise, it, they may spin I mean, something for it, an hour a once a week. Sometimes you got to pay, bro. But it's sometimes like I, I just was fortunate, fortunate enough to go around that part. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I established the, the relationship with the radio station and the DJs, then presented the music instead of presenting the music and trying to establish a relationship. Okay. Yeah, that's probably really? a smart way to go about it because up here they be on some old. 
But if it's local, they be trying to put you in a little contest and shit like that. They yeah, might spin yeah. you on a Saturday. Yeah. You, you got to go through those phases. Mm-hmm. There ain't nothing really wrong with going through a contest if you got good music. You know what I'm saying? No doubt. If you no got doubt. good music, your, your music going to go straight through that contest. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So that my life went through a contest, and it won the contest. Oh, okay, oh, so you so you won the contest and then got in rotation. Okay, then got in rotation. I mean, and okay. then people started calling and requesting it. You know what I'm saying? To keep it in rotation, people still got to like the song. No you doubt. know, it's good to hear a track like that get airplay too, because man, yeah, because nowadays, man, God. every you know everybody wants the club banger. You know what I'm saying? That, I mean, it ain't nothing okay. wrong with that club music got its place, but when that shit just dominates the airways and ain't no other type of music getting no run, then you got a problem. At the end of the day, we still got to teach. These, these kids, what's up? Damn, Skippy. Yeah. Definitely. For real, we for real. Show, show the right way to go. You know That's it. For sure. So what's That's next how, for you, man? That's how my music is. Yeah, for sure. So, I mean, what's next for you, though, as far as the independent movement, man? Are you going to try to stay independent and just keep building it, or are you looking to latch on with a major or what? I mean, it depends. Like, I, I wouldn't mind latching out with a major, but as far as independent now... It, it, it feels and looks like the right way to go. You feel me? Mm-hmm. I mean, I'm about to shoot a movie, man. I got a lot of stuff that's going on that I'm learning that we really don't need no majors. You know what I'm saying? Thank yeah, you. Thank you, man. Thank you. Know you. I, you get, I'll get my publishing, my own publishing company. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to start finding little artists. You know what I'm saying? about me. I'm going to start finding little young artists, bring them, up on, bring them up under me and writing for them and just really just starting... Why, why I can't be the next Dev Jam? You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. Thank you, man. Yeah, yeah. More cats need to do it that way, man. I, shoot, I would love to see you keep it independent, man. And I heard Prince say he had never signed with a major label again. Yeah. Who said that, Prince? Prince. Prince, ah, bro. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. You know I mean? <laughs> he has never, ever signed to a major label again. What do you Good. know? What do you know about everything you know in the game now? And that's 20 years. For real, man. for real. Really? Yeah. yeah. I mean, you hear that? Did you guys hear that new uh, Talib Kweli track? He just put out about being independent. He no, shouted out like, oh man, he just shouted out like every indie label out there: Asylum, oh, Stone yeah. Throw, you know, Definitely, Duck Down. Because yeah, you're getting them. that freedom, man. Hell what yeah, want to do? You know, it's good. Man. That's a movement, man. That's good stuff to see, especially in hip hop. And being, at the end of the day, man, you you really turn into a corporation. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You really plan. You would want to keep your own money. You know what I'm saying? Or give your 15 percent to your cousin you know mm-hmm. what i'm saying or you see into, instead of letting somebody else control your career and Hell what you yeah. do and where you go keep it all in the family for real well so man what's um you want to go ahead and get your websites out there get your all right man my web my website fattydaddy.com okay okay uh f-a-d-d-y-d-a-d-d-y my myspace is fatty daddy music you know what i'm saying it's myspace.com slash backslash fatty daddy music you know what i'm saying all right hit me cool. up on there uh, it's going down in Dallas, man. We got a movement going down, there, going on down here, bro. I mean, we're gonna start. We're gonna go to Atlanta with it. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to all the court DJs out there. Mm-hmm. I'm finna start messing with them real tough. The mixed bosses, you know what I'm saying? No it's doubt. It's gonna go down, bro. Oh, I, yeah. I mean, I got a lot of stuff going on, man. Well, that's what's up, man. Appreciate, appreciate the love, man. No doubt, Let me man. get on the hood, right. you know what I'm saying? We keep putting out that great music. Definitely, we'll man. Yeah, get us it. some more tracks, man. So we would love to spin you again, for real. Oh, for sure. I got, I mean, that ain't even the best one, man. I got, man, I got some stuff that'll, <laughs> that'll blow your head up. Y'all oh, better, shit. yeah, man. Get that to us. I want my head to explode. Well, hell yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got some shit that'll blow your head up, bro. <laughs> hell you know yeah. Man? Hey, y'all, it'll fuck your head up. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm going to say about it, too. That's what that is. Bet it, man. Check out the MySpace. If you check out the MySpace and listen to the music, man, you'll see what it do. All right. right, right, We're going to tell our listeners to check you out, man. We'll post it up on the website and everything. Thanks for your time, man. Thank you. All right, man. All right, boss. All right. Big shout out right there to Fatty Daddy, man. We about to go ahead and jump into this next one. This um, I don't know how you pronounce it. Is it Benasaur or Benasaur? I think it's Benasaur. Yeah, but it's like Cavassier, but it's it's yeah. It's sophisticated. Ben, ben Swab, Ben Swab, something. <laughs> this shit called Shiny Man <laughs> featuring Junior Reed. It's got the reggae feel oh, to it, man. Yeah. And we got a couple of these joints for y'all today, man. So let's get into it, man. Yo, Episode Google number sixty-one. Shit. Google that, man. Google that. You tell me what you want. 